Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the new save file. We are jumping in again and we're going to play as Golem as you just saw there. Unfortunately I lost my streak because I did start a Golem run and then my PC just crashed and turned off. Um, and then the run is no longer continuable. So it is what it is. But we're going to jump in as Golem. It was annoying as well. We only did about three rooms but we had actually a pretty good start to a run. So a little frustrating for that to happen but... Here we are anyways, um, we can, f we're free to grind this one aren't we, so we'll grind this one, um, and we will crush this one, occasionally fires freezing teas, I actually really like that, that's, that's very, very nice, that's, that's one that I definitely want to smelt to myself, and then charms, enemies in a small radius, okay, I'm pretty happy with this, we've got, uh, double the amount of charm here, charming female enemies and charming the enemies around us, we have the charm build. We have the charm build. Uh, as for the question of the day, let's keep it in theming. Um, what would you say is like your charm? What, what would you say is a bit of your personality that you think is something that makes people like you? Uh, for, for me, I feel like, like, oh, these guys got a new sprite. I feel like I'm just like fairly easy to talk to, uh, or at least I've been told that before. I think it's probably pretty obvious considering I, I do YouTube. I was going to say for a living, but I don't really do YouTube for a living. Um, it's more something I do on the side, but um, by the way, this mallet is fucking so good. Ooh, what's going on here then? I'm just going to take the damage. I don't care. I want Dumpy. I took the damage again. That was stupid, but still, I want Dumpy. Um, Dumpy is love. Dumpy is life. Uh, yeah, obviously it might it might be kind of obvious considering oh they're female okay interesting um considering like I do YouTube but yeah like I've been told quite a lot that I'm like very easy to talk to um and like I don't know I'm just that sort of person that you can talk to easily so I'm I'm glad to hear that for, um I've, it's mainly my girlfriend that's told me that so I don't know if it's verified by other people but I think I think it is <laughs> I think other people find that as well um hey thank you for the secret room. We get the red map here. Unfortunately, we can't actually get over there without flight. Um, damn, that's a really damn good... Uh, it's a damn good item as well, and we've got no way of getting it right now, so... That upsets my spaghetti in a huge, huge way. Anyways, let's keep it going. But I'm, I'm definitely willing to smelt both of these to our body, um, if we can. What the hell? <laughs> Oh my goodness, that's lovely, so nice. I'm liking this charming in a close radius, but it's not always working out for us. Dude, this mallet is so goddamn good, I love it. Um, What item did we have in our shop? We definitely had a soul heart, so we can buy that at least. I don't remember what else we had. Okay, we'll definitely just buy the soul heart, because the other thing is Mr. Me. Uh, we can also do this. It's just so good. God damn, it's so good. This mallet is amazing. Although we no longer have it for our boss now, which is a little upsetting. It uses two charges per use as well, so... Okay, can we get can we get the double bomb? Oh, Dumpy went off at a pretty opportune time there. Dude, just get near it, and then it charms it, and then it runs into itself. Nice. Okay, then here we get... Cumulative luck range, tears, or shot speed up when entering a secret room. Um, okay, so, so for now, let's just take that and um, and turn it into HP. Bow. Beautiful. And we'll step on out. And we'll chisel all this to our nice chiseled body. Right, uh, what we're looking at in terms of paths. We want to go dark path probably here. I'm, I'm liking the look of this run so far. I'm liking the look of this run. Right, so. Go in here, see what we got going on. Pisces, pretty darn good. It makes us look really cool as well with this resprite. Um, okay. Chisel me, baby. I want it all. These two things seem pretty good. I, am a, I, I have to admit, I'm a little scared of my current HP now. But it was worth it. Holy fuck, I hate this. <laughs> oh my goodness, what the hell? Why? You just gotta charm them all and hope they fight to the death. I love that. 
<laughs> so funny. Okay, we actually got some HP given to us there. That's pretty nice. Righty-ho, then. Righty-ho. But yeah, as for the question of the day, um, did I already say it? I can't remember. I can't remember if I talked about it in the last episode or this one. I'm pretty sure I talked about it in this one. <laughs> My brain's melting, people. My brain's melting. Did I do question of the day? If I, if I did, good. If I didn't, then please make one up and answer it. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone can have their own question of the day that they've made up. I genuinely cannot remember if I said it already. Because I've it's it's cause I had to record one and then scrap the start. It's confused the hell out of me. Oh dude, I'm loving having some of these female enemies permanently charmed. This is real nice. It reveals secret rooms too, baby. Dude, look at this. Oh my god, I'm loving it. Um, small chance to fire short range splash um, of tears when enemies are close. Small chance to create a creep puddle. Not bad. Little bit of moolah, little bit of moolah. I like it, I like it. Do I still have chance to fire my freezing tears or has that ability been removed? Okay, I'm liking this. Ah, oh, dude, that was a bad hit. I'm trying to get close to fire more of these little, little tears at people. But I'm liking this. Oh, bollocks. Thank you, Dumpy, for saving me there, because that was a really stupid place for me to get hit. I'm glad you had my back. Oh, my lord. Glad you had my back. But I have a lot of things that happen when enemies are close now. I charm them, I can create creep puddles, it's all sorts of good. 20% chance to give a random bonus charge, spawns a battery on pickup, I love it. Bomb this and try and get a soul heart here. We did briefly get a soul heart, but now it's gone. Okay, um... Hmm, I think we should just do the boss right now. Look how much damage that does to the boss. Like, that's insane. This is this is a quality one item, apparently. Quality one up my ass. I am loving this. Um, this will be bad now, but good for later, so I'll take it. It's actually really bad now. Grants a stony gaper familiar that pushes enemies around and blocks shots. Nice, okay. Um, probably want to save it for the angel deal. Probably want to save it for the angel deal. Yeah, let's just go to the next floor. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to gobble up these pills, though. Health down is not really what we're looking for, so that's a little annoying. But let's just take it as it is. Go to the next floor. Happy as can be. By the way, my fan's on in the background. I apologize if you can hear that going off. I will do this. I'm very, very happy we decided to do this. That's a lot of keys. Dumpy me boy. God damn, our damage is so bad now. Okay, so it looks like I can't fire these freezing tears, by the way. It looks like that ability was removed when I uh, decided to attach it to myself, which is fair. But yeah, unfortunately our damage is now abysmal. But a few damage ups in the suppository will do its work. Oh, dude, I forget that the head deals damage. I don't know what HP I'm on right now, but it's low. Oh, dude, this guy's pushing this guy around. I don't like that. Please stop. Please stop. <laughs> You've just accelerated this guy to insane rates. My guy, please stop. We do not need a highly accelerated boy. At least we got Dumpy to keep our health in check. God damn, it's funny. Hammer time, baby. I don't like this guy pushing things around. I think we're going to have to scrap this man. It's very frustrating. He's pushing them around at amazing speeds. My guy, you are going in the scrapper. And instead, what we've got here. T 
Tears up damage you up grants a random worm trinket at the start of every floor for the duration of the floor. Do not mind that. Unless we get a Rob Ross worm, then we'll be very sad. You see that? That was beautiful. The beautiful hammer at work. It's natural habitat. Dude, it just kills so fast. Especially if we're getting the 20% chance for the extra charges on room clear too. We can use this thing so much. Do, they, do these things jump at me? No, they don't. Oh, God. We need to use it as well because our actual damage is so terrible. Oh, wait. We can freeze. Okay, it must just be a really, really low chance. Soul Heart here. We need that. Sadly, nothing there. Secret rooms. Secret rooms. Where art thou? I want to see my angel deal, but I'm going to save up, um, I'm going to save up enough charges to just mallet him to death. At the minute, I'd only have one usage. Beggars pay out twice. Um, well, at least we can, oh, wait, 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 do, do that on the way out, actually. Do that on the way out. Right, back this way. Oh, I, I got a double charge for that room as well. Nice. We're almost at full charge. Beautiful. Right, item room, where art thou as well? These guys are friendly, which is real nice. Are they going to kill each other? Haha! -ha! Amazing. So much charm. So much charm. I love it. Seems to be a lot of spider related enemies that are female. Why is that? <laughs> Why is that that it's mainly just spider enemies that are female? Right. Keep it moving along. We've got a hammer fully ready now. Secret room is likely here. Let's open it up. Oh, dude, 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 dude. That was scary. Um, chance to spawn a friendly lost soul in uncleared rooms. If it's still alive at the end of the room, spawns a pickup reward. That's pretty nice. That's pretty nice. Um, do that. Right, let's, let's quickly go in here and... Let's um, put that worm trinket, I think. Do I put the worm trinket in there? Yeah, I think the worm trinket. Good HP. Thank you. Back into secret room. We'll grab this and see how this works. Um, death cap, unfortunately, just isn't very good for us right now. Because, like, we really do need the... Um, we really do need the the damage and stuff. We can't be giving away with stats. Okay, friend. Uh... Still haven't seen that item room. Here we go. Thank you, Dumpy. Although, Dumpy, you've done something terrible. You've managed to, like, back yourself into a place where I can no longer retrieve you, which I, I stand against. I do not like that you've done that. Oh, dude, this is... This room's tricky. Having burnies like this that I basically can't deal any damage to. Dude, stand in the creep, please. Thank you. I do, I do so low damage that these guys are like an absolute nightmare. Oh my god. I don't know how much health I have left, but it can't be a lot. Justice. It can't be a lot. Decent for extra random shots, I guess. Dude, fucking die! Oh my god, my damage is so bad. Ah, we got a soul heart back out of that. Good, good, good. My goodness. Dude, I just used that and it did nothing. These enemies are going to be tedious as shit. Managed to slow him with a slowing tear. Come on now. Okay. After a long battle, we are ready to go. We're gonna need damage ups. Like, seriously. We are gonna need damage ups. <laughs> what did our shop have to offer? No good items.
Yeah, that's not really enough damage, is it? I'm gonna have to use bombs here. Sadly, even that's gonna be a little slow, and you could easily jump over them. Damn you, bastards. Okay, try and create as much creep as we can. Get him in the creep. Dude, the eyes get out of my face. Dude, he's got creep as well. He's got piss as well. Need damage, game. Need damage. Real bad. No angel deal here. That's not great. Um, chance 10 pickups into their doubled equivalent. Um, chance to double room rewards. That's probably a little bit better than the ghosty. So let's take that. So first, actually, let's go grab that. Grab that. And come in here and... Turn both of those into HP. And then come back out here. Grab that. And grab that. And to the next floor. Yeah, a little bit worried. Don't know what HP is looking like. Okay, my HP is actually fine. But yeah, a little bit worried about not having damage right now. That's really going to be a bummer for a little while here because our damage is, yeah, abysmal. Um, <laughs> we need, like, one damage up for it to be fine as well. Like, I'm hoping this, this floor we get an angel deal and that somehow solves the issue. But right now, we're just going to have to bide our time and wait it out. Tears now shot on an arc. Let's take this first. Nice. Okay. Let's grab that. Nope. I wanted to grab. Yeah. Go. Yeah. Come in here. And I want to. Yeah, change you into health. Smelt you onto me. Come out here. Grab this back. Okay. Pretty happy. Pretty happy. God, rooms where I don't have my hammer ready is going to be sad. It's going to be sad. I'm hoping charm can carry me through this. Nice bit of herming there to use in the boss fight, potentially. Small rock. Okay, there you go. There's the damage that we needed. Awesome. We're up to four damage. That literally changed everything for us. I literally changed everything for us. That's so goddamn nice. This has awakened our run. Like I said, it's literally all we needed was one damage up to change it. And then any future damage ups we get on top of that will be even better. Lol. Get wrecked. Man, this mallet. I absolutely love this thing. Because it has like that radius effect where um, it continues dealing damage after the fact as well. I doubt it can blow up these blue fires, but I've got to try. I can't, no. Okay, so what's this? Grants a swordfish familiar that skewers enemies, um, then launches them. Launches enemies... Launch enemies damage... Oh, that sounds really cool. Okay, we'll take that. One soul heart. Not, not terrible for four bombs, but not great. But yeah, we lost a bit of tears up there, but... I'm kind of intrigued by this whole... Skewering mechanic. Skewering and then launching enemies. I like the idea. So I skewer an enemy. And then what? <laughs> we froze a couple of fellas there. Nice. And item room. Fuck yes. Cancer is amazing. We need to remember that with their cancer, it makes um, sack rooms real goddamn good. I always forget that. 
So basically, it like sticks the enemy to our face and then we push him into a wall. That's pretty nice. It can only be done once every now and again by the looks of it, though. Okay, good. We want to take our shop as well. Weird that our shop's not close to our boss. It's normally where it, where it resides. So, Sakroon will be playing this. Because we got a ton of HP and we can get a lot of value out of it for Angel items. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine. Oh, I, I stuck the boss to me. Nice. Damn it, I was really hoping that would be the HP. The money's nice, but not exactly what I was looking for. Okay, I'm liking this. My Kane to the Rye is doing some janky stuff as well with firing all over the place. I'm liking it. Dude, that's really nice that it works on bosses. Good, good. Okay, we lost a lot of HP there, but I think that was overall pretty goddamn worthwhile. I'm liking this triple shot thing we got going on as well. I know the other, other tiers disappear, but still... Oh, dude, we can attach a frozen enemy. That's pretty cool. How does it work with these guys? <laughs> oh, my God. Jankily. Definitely the HP. I guess there's no reason not to take this. Right, this isn't a chisel floor, is it? I don't think. Completely with that. Okay, good, good, good. Charge key, give me that. Right, boss time. It is Le Boss time. Yeah, I love Cancer and um, Wafer for sack rooms. So powerful. Uh, there's another boss in here. <laughs> Where the fuck did you come from? What the fuck was that about? <laughs> Excuse me? Excuse me, man. Excuse me. Ooh, very nice. Okay, um... Grab that real quick. Occasionally throws a rock at enemies, it said. J yeah, no, no, we'll still... We'll still Meld this one. Okay, that was confusing. Oh, wait, we can. We can smell it. Here's this floor. Nice. Awesome. I gotta say, I really wanted to stick that one to myself because it's very good. Down to the next floor. Slow going runs as this character, but I like him. It's not too bad. Um, hammer. Ah, not a single other key. I was really hoping I'd get one other key out of that. Dude, I'm money. I'm money's wild. Took you to me. Oh my god. The enemies are going to spawn locusts on death occasionally. If we can get anywhere to spawn blue flies, we're winning as well. Okay. Look at, oh my god. It's so amazing, I love it. So goddamn powerful. <laughs> oh my god, I love it. 
We got a little bomb guy here, bomb locust, be careful. Amalgamation of hearts. Oh god. I stuck that guy to myself and I was not happy about it. Thank you, Dumpy, for saving me from this creature. Oh, there's some creep on the floor. My bad. My bad. Haha, -ha, you may go invisible, but I have a hammer. Nothing can beat my hammer. Okay. Dumpy. Come on now. I'm guessing once I kill these, the rocks will open up? Yeah, good. A little bit worried there. Come on, Key, where are you? Dude, so many bombs, no keys. <laughs> I don't know why we're getting extra bosses in our boss room. I'm not quite sure what's causing that, but clearly not a great idea for that boss. Because it just insta-died. Dude. Bugger off me. Fuck this boss, man. Fuck this boss. Where's the actual piece that I kill? I think I've bugged the boss. Right? But the brain is gone. Okay, one minute. Uh, debug 10. There you go. I bugged the boss. The brain was gone. It just disappeared. Okay, cool. Uh, give me that. Extra speed. Thank you, I guess. 99 coins now. Goddamn. Double the sacks. Thank you muchly. Okay, there's our keys at least, finally. A extra soul heart as well. Thank you. Got a lot of red hearts now as well. Get dippies away from me. Shop could be valuable, but it will be greed. You know it'll be greed to have this much money. Oh, no, it's not. Wow. Okay. Unfortunately, it is still crap, though. <laughs> it is still not useful at all. Right. Item room. Where art thou? I'm liking the speed up out of combat. That's nice. Smackdown. Double golden key. Gotta love the double golden key. Oop. Chesty. Oh, really? I hit that spike? Come on now. Nonsense. Um. <sighs> Unfortunately, that's not really very good for us. It's a bit of a shame, really. Chance to fire a slowing tier, leaves large pulls of white creep. Uh, yeah. Let me do my booty in there. I'm going to re-roll this one a little bit. Try and get something good. Drops a keep on pickup? Nah. Fine. Try and re-roll for something good. Nah. Bet the start of every floor is not super useful for us. Nah, not very good either. Obviously, I'm going to use a lot of money on this, but it's fine. One soul heart starter floor. That's pretty good, but I'm looking for something DPS based. Oh, I just re rolled the other one by accident. Um, well, that's an insane speed boost, but we don't really need it. Okay, that's pretty good. I like that. Oh, 
Oh, I just... I keep... I do, keep doing that. Okay, it doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Keep re-rolling by accident. Periodically fires brimstone beams at random direction. Okay, that seems pretty darn good. Um... No, thanks. Come on, give us something damaging. Ooh, yeah, okay. Tennis balls that inflict bruising. Okay, I'm, I'm happy. I'm happy. Do a boss room. Let's get the hell out of here. Okay. Reasonably happy with those two. Can I smelt them both straight away? Let's see. Chisel, 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 baby. Chisel, chisel, chisel. Good, good. Awesome. Right, let's keep this party moving. Keep this party going. Haha, -ha, you are all charmed, baby. Hey, there's, there you go. There's a little brimstone. It seems to be a pride brimstone. Uh, what, what, what pride flag is that? I can't remember what, what pride flag that is. That... I'm going to have to go Google that now, because I'm, I'm, I'm intrigued. That's definitely a, a pride flag colour, right? Pride flags. <laughs> the article that I found on what pride flags are which and what they mean is by Volvo? <laughs> I'm not... Volvo? Why? <laughs> I am. Um, no, I, I don't think I'm finding it in here. Um, it might be the lesbian. It, wait, no. It's, yeah, the lesbian one. It look, maybe it, that that goes from red to orange to white to pink. I think it's that one, right? It, it might not be intentional, but it it very much looks this looks the same. Yeah, that, 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 that's like pink to white to orange. Yeah. That feels like it has to be intentional, right? It actually looks like a pretty cool color for a brimstone beam. I'll, I'll give it that. Don't mind if I do. I think he sticks to the one direction he picks each room. He changes direction each room, but then sticks to that direction. Periodically spawns pull root saplings around the room. Um, pull roots are temporarily familiars that uh, can be thrown at enemies to deal high damage. Very intriguing. I get the brimstone going on there. Brimstone going on there. Dumpy. We can... So there's a pull root here. Oh, I can like throw it by like shooting it around the room. I see. It's not like a thrown thing. I guess it's pretty good. Finally, here you are. Nice. Okay, I can get these pull roots out the ground. Do they come with us between rooms? That they do. That they do. Uh, I quite like this item now, actually. We haven't done the beast. Beast would be a good shout. Secret room, lovely. Damage up if a curse is present. I like that. Lovely. Soul high out of it as well. I haven't really been seeing too many tennis balls, but they are there on occasion. What have we done this floor? We, okay, we've done pretty much everything this floor. I'm not going to bother pissing around. Nice. Brimstone's facing a good direction here. Shoot our pull roots at enemies. 
Everything's charmed. I like the fact that the full roots have a few different sprites as well. That's pretty cool. Ow. So, okay, I took a bit of damage. It's fine. Nice. Tears have a chance to be... Ooh, nice. I like that. And then we're doing Dark Path. Let's go. Bit of a slower run here, but it is what it is. I think I just got to shoot the pull root to like unearth it. I don't think I've got to like touch it, as I originally thought. Good. Give me that. Especially when we've got so many tears firing around. Qu quite easy for us to accidentally hit the pull roots, which is kind of nice. And yeah, this look based chance. I know it looks bad at the minute, but look based chance to fire these herming tears seems good too. Especially when we fired so many tears. This room not over yet? What the hell? Oh, it's you, I see. You just keep moving around. Yeah, little shyster. I remember we got to s still got to focus on sack rooms. If we find them. If, if we've got enough HP. Right now we don't, but in general when we have enough HP to play them. Don't know what secret room is this time around. I'm not going to bother... Taking the time to look the beautiful. Calm down, my boy. Calm down, dude. These pull roots are like crazy. There's so many of them. And do pretty good damage too. I like them. I like them a lot. Give me them all. There's another sack room. It's tempting, but our HP is a little low right now. I don't know if I want to take that risk. Give me another two soul hearts and I'll do it. Nice one. Uh, yeah, I'm glad I don't have to go and touch them because it means I can just like passively have these guys coming out of the ground. And then the fact that you have to follow you between rooms as well is even better. God, that was amazing. I'm using the hammer whenever I get the chance. Ah, yes, my brimstone boy's facing the right way. Also, again, another reworked boss. Boss has some different stuff about it. Oh, we get to fight reworked mum again. Yes, I'm excited for that. Box, unfortunately, here. Um, occasionally, burn up enemies. Ooh, okay, let me... Let me take that. No, 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 no. Let me take that. No. Let me do that. There you go. Right. And then we grind this up and it'll smelt all the trinkets when we do that, right? No, I got that wrong. <laughs> My bad. Rocks may drop. Um, half hearts when broken. Mm, pretty good. I'm not... Uh, missed that. I'll take it. Hmm. Also pretty interesting. Let's just take both of these in for now. And... Uh, we'll do something with them. Turn that one into HP. You know what? Turn that one into HP as well. Then come out here. I've now got uh, health to play the thingy, so let's take that. And I think I'm going to re-roll this rocks one into something better. Try and get something good. Damage and shot speed up when near a fire. Eh, not great. Plus two luck. It's nice, but eh, not super advantageous. Permit geode be bonus when smelted. Do you know what? Yeah, I I'll, I'll take that because later on I think we do have some geodes smelted onto us. Right. Go back and play our sack room. As I said, if I get another two soul hearts, I'd play it and I'm definitely there now. As I said, tis a slow run, but it's fine. Right. Okay. 
Are you going to get an item for this? Good, good. Dude, I don't want you. Get out of here. Ah, oh, again, really? I was really hoping for the soul hearts again this time. Damn you, game. Damn you. It's fine. Let's just go. Let's just go. I could skip to the dark room, I guess, but I kind of want to fight the new mum. The new mum's heart. Right, down we go. The new mum's heart fight is pretty darn cool. Let's just hope we can take the right direction here. And actually make it over there. Good. Get all these things out the ground for me. Beautiful. So much money and nothing to do with it, really. Bruising enemies are at a pretty rapid rate as well, which is nice. Oh, Dumpy allows me to probably get in there with a the hammer as well. I really like that. Thank you, Dumpy, for supporting my aggressive tactics with this hammer. I love you, Dumpy. Seems like I'm going the right way so far, but you never really know with uh, the wound. A beautiful... Oh! Eternal heart proc. Thank you. Yes, we went the right way first time. That's beautiful to see. Okay, a little bit risky on this, but let's give this a go. Gotta remember this is a whole new boss now. Lots of new attacks. Lots of new stress. Dumpy, you are going to be my saving grace here. Really cool. I really, really like this rework of this boss. This, this boss, like I said, has always bothered me as, like, one that was really sort of basic and meh. Same with, like, Blue Baby and stuff, and that got reworked as well. It's just great. Still think this attack lasts a little bit long, but otherwise, I really like this boss fight. I think this could definitely do to be at least half the time that it is now. There you go, we got her. And all stats up. Um, hmm. Quickly go down here and check. Hmm. Okay, good, good, good. All stats up. Nice. Right, down we go. Dark room it is. Beautiful. Would have been nice to have the, the getting red hearts from destroyed rocks now, actually, because uh, we're only on red hearts and we can destroy rocks incredibly easily, so... Probably would have been good to keep that, but I wasn't thinking we'd be on only red health, to be honest. Oh, lovely. This guy plus this uh, head. Not a good mix for me. Not a good mix. Oh, dude. You know I hate it when you do that. Why do you always do the electricity one? Fucking do a different attack, you bitch. We got Wrath, though. Wasn't expecting Wrath, but I will certainly take it. Good stuff, good stuff. Right, let's hope we can be quick here. Nice. Oh, extra soul heart as well. Very, very nice. But yeah, at this point, the uh, the reworked first mod, like I said, you definitely want to be using it regardless of if you've not like played modded before, I think. It's just too good to not, not use. Uh, but also, it's getting to the point now where it's like, it's reworked, like, a ridiculous amount of stuff. Like, so many stuff. Like, I can't imagine what other stuff they're going to need to rework, to be honest. They've got to be hella close to, like, having reworked everything that needs reworking. The only thing I can imagine them doing next is maybe 
reworking and rebalancing some of the other stuff in mod is in like mods because i know they've got some compatibility for like fiend folio so my god if 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 they made another like offshoot mod that reworked and fixed some of the fiend folio bosses boy i would be an ecstatic little camper that would be so good My bad, I got hit there. Right. Hammer time, baby. And then launch you off. Hammer time again. Get Dumpy involved. Okay, launching this guy's bad because he does that. Yep. Dude, Wrath is going crazy right now. I think it's we've got this triple tier thing going on. Look at the damage. Mad. I like it. Vomit Grimace. I don't actually know what that Vomit Grimace is going to do, but I'll keep it on my head. Why not? Right, I got some devil deals here. See if you want to take any. The scythes I will definitely take. The rest I'm going to leave. I'm a little bit scared of um, how much HP I now have. Well, let's ignore that, shall we? Let's just completely ignore that and pretend it's fine. I found pills and ate them. I mean, we're killing stuff extremely fast now, so... Hey, we just got a Rotten Heart, which gives us ways to guarantee generate Locusts. That's really nice. It's only two per room, but still. Two Locusts is a lot better than none. Dude, Wrath is just going off, baby. Interesting room. What's, what's this about? Clammy, jumpy boy. Thank you. But yeah, we now have a dice shard in case we want to re-roll something. Don't know how I didn't get hit there. Ooh, extra soul heart. God damn, does that feel good to see? Right, this is good stuff. I'm liking it. Good stuff. Not liking that room though. Get that get that the hell away from me. Dude. So many tears. The bruising is going like crazy. Well. I think that's why I'm doing so much damage, because I'm applying that bruising, which increases our damage dealt to them. Oh, that was a very bad hit. Why didn't I re-roll the quarter? Why did I take that? It was so pointless. This guy is as good as dead. I think I managed to move him with my swordfish there and it got me hurt. Slightly annoying. Anyways, get back to Mega Satan. Very low HP to be attempting Mega Satan, but do remember we do take half damage uh, after our first hit, so not terrible. Probably should have dice shattered those actually as well and see if we got anything that gave us HP. Should be a reasonably quick kill, though. I'm able to move his hand with the swordfish. That's pretty funny. A lot of tears are about right now. I don't particularly like that. Dump oh, dude, Dumpy, why? He's gone over to a location that I literally can't retrieve him from. That's evil, Dumpy. I can't believe you'd do that. The, tear, the tears is just absolutely filling the screen right now with tears. Oh, we got hit there, damn it.
You are taking a beating, good boy. You are taking a beating. Aha, I pulled your face off. Do I have, like, mum's eye or something? I'm shooting a lot of tears at the back of my head. Maybe that's Kane that's doing that. Kane's other eye. Damn, yeah, there's so many tennis balls. I didn't think it'd be so many, but going good. Give me your hand, boy. Onto the angels. Ooh, they have a new spawning animation. That's very cool. Very cool indeed. I thought our brimstone's facing down here, which doesn't help us. Okay. You've, you're so close to death. Just just perish already. Oh, dude, we've taken quite a lot of damage, actually. I hadn't realized how many hits we'd taken here. Okay. Second phase is going to be a bit risky. We've got three hits remaining. Considering I can't see much, I don't know how well this is going to go. Okay, I got hit straight away there, so that's good. It's mainly because I can't goddamn see. Only thing is as well, his attacks are pretty hard to dodge. Yeah, there you go, we got hit again. Not looking good. Not looking good. One hit remaining, about half of his HP to go. There's some of his attacks that I just can't dodge though, so if he does them, I'm kind of screwed. The fire ones are probably the better attacks that he does. It's the normal tears that really screw you over. This is one of the ones that screws you over a lot. A lot of weirdly moving tears. Don't really know what to say or think about that. Oh, we did it. Nice. Okay. Very close call there, baby. Very close call. But we got it in the end. And we are definitely not doing Mega Satan. Uh, not this one. Not Mega Satan. You know what I mean? Either way, hope you guys enjoyed that one. I'll see you guys in the next one.